Stop Boycotting Starbucks Malaysia. This is Berjaya Corp Berhad founder Vincent Tan's plea to Malaysians, saying the boycott doesn't benefit anyone but only hurts the locals running the company. The business tycoon said up to 85% of Starbucks Malaysia's employees were Muslims and that there were no foreigners working in the company's head office. However, Tan said the boycott seemed to be tapering out, with Starbucks Malaysia's sales slowly improving. He expects further improvement in sales to be reflected in the company's finances for the third quarter of 2024. Tan's Berjaya Food Berhad faced significant challenges due to the boycott of Starbucks in Malaysia, made worse by the weakening of the ringgit against the dollar. The boycott, sparked by the Israel-Palestine conflict, heavily impacted B-Food as Starbucks Malaysia contributes 90% of the group's revenue.